Tesla's self-driving cars have landed down under. For years, Australians have watched the self-driving revolution unfold from afar, wondering when our turn would come. Now that moment has arrived. The unmistakable silhouette of a Tesla gliding silently along our roads is no longer just a glimpse of tomorrow. It's the reality of today. As of today, August 30th, 2025, Australia is the first country in the world to allow Tesla's full self-driving, FSD, on public roads. This historic decision marks a bold leap into the future, setting a global precedent and putting Australia firmly on the map as a leader in transport innovation. The news has sent ripples through the automotive world, with headlines lighting up screens and conversations everywhere. While the rest of the world watches, we get to see these cars in action, from Melbourne's laneways to the Nullarbor Plain. Whether it's weaving through the bustling heart of the city or cruising across the vast open stretches of the outback, Teslas are now seamlessly navigating the diverse landscapes that make Australia unique. It's a sight that's both futuristic and unmistakably Aussie. This isn't a small trial, it's a nationwide rollout. From the sun-drenched coasts to the red center, every corner of the country is part of this grand experiment. Thousands of Teslas are hitting the roads, gathering data, learning, and adapting to our unique driving conditions. It's a massive coordinated effort that's transforming the way we think about travel. Imagine heading to the Gold Coast and letting your car do most of the driving. Picture yourself relaxing as your Tesla handles the traffic, the navigation, and even the tricky roundabouts, all while you enjoy the view of the sparkling ocean. Road trips are being redefined, making long journeys safer, more comfortable, and more enjoyable for everyone. It feels like science fiction, but it's real, and it's happening here. Families are experiencing the thrill of hands-free driving for the first time, and drivers are discovering a new sense of freedom behind the wheel. The technology is intuitive, responsive, and constantly improving, making every trip feel like a step into a new era. The news is everywhere, and car enthusiasts are buzzing. Social media is flooded with videos of Teslas navigating city streets and country roads, while experts debate what this means for the future of transport. From talk shows to tech blogs, everyone's got an opinion, and everyone's watching Australia. Australia is now at the forefront of a transport revolution. We're not just adopting new technology, we're shaping it, testing its limits, and showing the world what's possible when innovation meets opportunity. The roads are changing, and so is the way we move, work, and live. The future has arrived, and it's parked right outside. For many Australians, the dream of a self-driving car is no longer a fantasy, it's a part of daily life. Whether you're commuting to work, picking up the kids, or heading out for a weekend adventure, the future of mobility is here, ready to take you wherever you want to go. Welcome to the future, Australia. The journey has just begun, and the road ahead is wide open. Buckle up. It's going to be an incredible ride. Is it like Knight Rider? Not quite. While the idea of a car that drives itself conjures up images of sci-fi classics, Tesla's full self-driving, or FSD, doesn't mean you can just sit back, relax, and let your car whisk you away while you nap or watch a movie. The reality is a bit more grounded, but still pretty remarkable. FSD is an advanced driver assistance system, not a fully independent chauffeur. It's designed to help you with the most challenging parts of driving, but it's not a replacement for a human behind the wheel. You're still the captain of the ship, even if the car is doing a lot of the heavy lifting. Think of it as the world's most skilled co-pilot, handling steering, accelerating, and braking. FSD can manage the car's speed, keep you centered in your lane, and even navigate through stop-and-go traffic. It's like having a driving assistant who never gets tired or distracted, always ready to help you out. Unlike basic autopilot, FSD tackles city driving, intersections, roundabouts, lane changes, and more. It can recognize traffic lights, stop signs, and even make complex turns. In busy urban environments, FSD is designed to handle the chaos of city streets, adapting to unpredictable situations and making driving less stressful. The real leap is in decision-making. FSD tries to replicate the hundreds of tiny judgments a human makes every minute. It's constantly scanning the road, analyzing the behavior of other drivers, and predicting what might happen next. Whether it's a pedestrian stepping off the curb or a cyclist weaving through traffic, FSD is always thinking ahead. 
but it's still a level 2 system. You must keep your hands on the wheel and eyes on the road. The technology is impressive, but it's not infallible. There are moments when the system might get confused or need your input, so your attention is absolutely required at all times. The car will remind you if you're not paying attention. If you ignore the warnings, it can even disengage FSD and slow the car down. Tesla wants to make sure you're always ready to take over, just in case the unexpected happens. No napping, no reading, no climbing into the back seat. FSD isn't a license to check out or treat your car like a private train carriage. You're still the responsible adult in the room, and the car expects you to act like it. It's a partnership. The car drives, but you're still responsible. FSD is there to make your life easier, not to take over completely. You and your Tesla are a team, working together to get from point A to point B safely and efficiently. So, less night rider, more like supervising a very capable student driver. The future of driving is here, but it still needs you in the driver's seat, alert, engaged, and ready to take control at a moment's notice. Why Australia? We're the perfect testbed. Our roads are a mix of modern highways, rural stretches, and chaotic city centers, ideal for training AI. Regulators here have worked closely with Tesla, creating a safe framework for public testing. Our left-side driving provides valuable data for other right-hand drive countries. If FSD works here, it can work almost anywhere. We're the lead penguin, diving in first. The world is watching to see what happens next. So, how does a Tesla actually drive itself? It's a question that seems almost like science fiction, but the answer is rooted in some seriously advanced technology. Let's break it down step by step and see what's really happening when you take your hands off the wheel and let the car do the work. First, let's peek under the bonnet, not just literally but figuratively too. While there's no magic under there, what you'll find is a combination of hardware and software working together in perfect harmony. Teslas are absolutely covered in cameras, eight of them to be exact. These cameras are strategically placed all around the car, giving it a full 360 degree view of its surroundings. They're constantly watching everything. The road ahead, the sides, the rear, and even what's happening at blind spots. Each camera has a specific job. Some focus on long range vision, others on close up details, and together, they create a digital map of the world around the car in real time. All this video footage is sent straight to a powerful onboard AI computer. This isn't just any computer, it's custom built by Tesla, designed to process huge amounts of data in the blink of an eye. But the real magic is in the software. Tesla's AI learns by watching millions of kilometers of driving footage, both from its own fleet and from other Teslas on the road. The AI analyzes every frame, identifying cars, pedestrians, cyclists, road signs, lane markings, and even unexpected obstacles. It's like having a superhuman set of eyes and a brain that never gets tired or distracted. But it doesn't stop there. The AI is constantly predicting what might happen next. For example, if it sees a cyclist near the curb, it can anticipate that the cyclist might turn or swerve, and it prepares to react accordingly. Based on all this information, the car makes split-second decisions. Should it accelerate, brake, or steer? It weighs up the safest and smoothest option, just like a careful human driver would, only much faster. This see-think-predict-act loop happens dozens of times every second. The car is always scanning, always thinking, always ready to act. It's a continuous process that keeps you safe, even in complex or unpredictable situations. When something unexpected happens, like a pedestrian suddenly stepping onto the road or a car swerving in front, the Tesla can react in a fraction of a second, often faster than a human could. It might look like magic, but it's really just the result of years of engineering, relentless data collection, and a super smart computer doing its homework every single day. Engineers are constantly updating the software, making the system smarter and safer with every new version. So, when you see a Tesla gliding down the highway with no hands on the wheel, remember, it's the cameras, the AI, and the relentless learning that make it possible. The future of driving is already here, and every journey is helping these cars get even smarter. With each kilometer, the system learns, adapts, and improves, making roads safer for everyone. 
What's in it for us? The biggest promise is safety. Human error causes most accidents. AI doesn't get tired or distracted. FSD could drastically reduce crashes, injuries, and deaths. Traffic could flow smoother. AI cars coordinate, reducing jams and travel times. Accessibility improves. Elderly and disabled people gain new independence. The AI drives efficiently, saving energy and money. Less stress on long drives or in traffic, more time to relax or connect with others. It turns dead time into useful time. While you still need to supervise, the mental load drops. Quality of life improves for many. FSD could transform daily life for millions. It's not all sunshine and smooth rides. FSD is still level two. Human supervision is essential. The biggest risk is complacency. Drivers trusting the system too much. The AI isn't perfect. Unusual situations can confuse it. Edge cases like a flooded road or a police officer directing traffic can trip it up. Critics warn Tesla may be moving too fast, using customers as beta testers. Legal questions remain. Who's at fault in a crash? We're entering new territory and the rules are still being written. FSD could reshape our cities, economy and way of life. Less need for city parking, cars can drop you off and park themselves elsewhere. Car ownership might shift to on-demand services, reducing the number of vehicles on the road. Trucking and logistics could run 24 7 cutting costs and delivery times. Insurance, ride-sharing and real estate would all be transformed. Commutes could become productive or relaxing, changing where people choose to live. But disruption is inevitable. Many driving jobs could disappear. We'll need to support those affected and plan for a new future. FSD is just the first step toward a very different Australia. The world is watching Australia's FSD experiment. Our successes and failures will shape global adoption. A smooth rollout here could set the standard for other countries. If things go wrong, it could delay self-driving tech worldwide. Every bit of data, every incident, will be scrutinized. This is a test for more than just cars. It's about how society adapts to automation. The lessons learned here will ripple across industries and borders. First though, FSD has to master a Melbourne hook turn. We're at a crossroads. One path leads to safer roads, less stress and more freedom. The other is full of uncertainty, trusting our lives to algorithms still learning on the job. The big question, are we ready to hand over control? For now, the law says eyes on the road and hands on the wheel, but every day more Australians will face the choice to trust the car. Only time and the open road will tell if we're truly ready.